Near death experience is maybe some product of our mind. Um, this is kind of like a atheism of the gaps almost, where they'll say the brain is a mystery, consciousness is still a mystery. We don't have all the answers, so but we're gonna figure it out. Near death experiences do have some sort of like naturalistic explanation. So, like, how do you respond to that? Again, <clears throat> I'm gonna go to the line of the sand type illustration. If if we're going to figure out someday, or particularly the brain is mysterious and we just don't know what it can do, how come I can see something? There are cases where people report what's going on in their home during uh, this state. What about, what about a mysterious brain experience allows me, when the machine says the brain is apparently not working, how can I report, this is an actual case, how can I report what my family is having for dinner back in our home while I'm in the hospital? How can I report that? There's nothing in faulty brains, goofy brains. We don't know what brains can do. Someday we'll be able to do it. That, well, you know, There's nothing there that says a brain that's not working can tell me something that's happening a mile away. That's ridiculous. Here's another one. What if I said, okay, Zach, here's my explanation. I don't like Einstein. And I don't like Einsteinian in physics or post Einsteinian in physics. And you go, well, I'm a physicist and you're stupid. You know, if you say it to him, I go, no, 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 Zach. Someday we may find out that post Einsteinian in physics is wrong. So you can't, you can't go into it right now because in 20 years they're going to find out it's wrong. We have to make decisions on what we have right now. And if you make decisions on what we have right now, you've got to ask yourself, what about the afterlife? What about it? If not, that's some tough decisions. I don't think these questions mostly are about the the brain being able to explain it. But the brain can't explain most of these NDEs on a good day. They can't explain a good they can't explain it on a good day. Let's say there's a there's a window in your hospital room. Can you see your home a mile away? And can you see inside your home a mile away? No. All right, then quit goofing around. You're not doing a very good job explaining these things. Hmm. So I, I I think I do think it would be very unnerving to be an atheist and have these experiences.